There's a brand new pearl in Mystic, but it didn't come from any of the local oysters. Marcy Jones is live at Pearl to find out how it's helping put the area on the map of great food towns. Marcy, how's it going? Hi there, it's going so great. I'm here with my new friend Moses, owner of Pearl Provisions and Temples. He's mixing up another cocktail for me. That's why we're already best friends, right? <laughs> That's it. Good morning. Good morning. So Moses, kind of take us through a little bit. We were just chatting off camera about the evolution of Mystic and kind of the whole scene around here because it is very different than it was 10, 15 years ago. So how do you kind of find it now as opposed to, you know, back in the day? Yeah, so, you know, my wife and partner, Lauren Wells, uh, we've been together for about 15 years. Mm -hmm. So her family's been here for about 35 years. I've been bouncing around here for about 15 years. Yeah. And it's way different, right? Yeah. 10, 15 years ago, it was kind of a sleepy town. And it's really evolving into kind of like this culinary mecca of, of Connecticut. I know. Really. Uh, you know, a couple of James Beard Award winners around here. Hopefully, um, I'm grooming the next one yeah. that's, that's downstairs yeah. and is going to present some uh, food soon. Uh, but yeah, I think it's becoming a really fun town. It's about a 10 month town now. I yep. think the holidays are really great here. Right. And you know, we're looking to just add to that. Like yesterday, for example, we had a pop-up omakase uh, so experience cool. with uh, 10 and 15 pieces of sushi. We're gonna try to do that every two weeks. Yep. Uh, I'm thinking of sliding in a burlesque show maybe once a wow, month. Wow, very down, cool. <laughs> downstairs in the speakeasy. Yeah, you guys have to check out the downstairs. It's really cool. It's that speakeasy kind of underground club vibe. I right, love it. it really has like those jazzy speakeasy easy kind of tones to it which I yep. think are a lot of fun and I think we can do a lot there yeah. um, so I think it's a great event so space really the sky is the limit and I love that you guys it's such a tight-knit town too like you all have each other's backs there's a great network here you know if you need a little inspo or somebody needs to help you out you can you scratch their back they scratch yours you know it's really awesome I, I couldn't agree with that more you know in the process of getting this place built Adam Young chef Adam Young over next door at yep, Sift over at Sift Bakery yeah, he was really a champion for this project and helped me out with an amazing amount of things and I could not be more grateful that is so cool. and I think it's it speaks to that small town kind of let we're friends let's help yeah. each other out yeah I love it oh speaking of chef <laughs> hey, he goes wait 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 there's no waiting it's live chef we got it all right really quick here kind of come swing over here so I my short arm can uh, reach you all right what do we got over here so we have a, a very special spicy Spicy reggaetoni Ooh, that's like I can that smell people are, that. <laughs> that people are going crazy. You know, we do everything in the house, yes. except the pasta. But we the pasta is a uh, is fresh. We have a very good purveyor. Okay. That you know he supplies at least five to six cases yep. a week. Again, people are, people are, go, are going, going crazy. Going crazy over it. You can't <laughs> keep that on the shelves. All right. And then what's this one? This one's so gorgeous. I'm going to tilt this up so you guys can see it. Oh, and this is our uh, a fluke. You know, we use a lot of, we try to go very seasonal with most of our ingredients. Yep. And this one is made of, uh, out of wow. orange, out of or, like fresh orange that we squeeze, we reduce, and we turn it into a beautiful uh, leche de tigre. Okay. And, um, and again, this is one of my favorite because it's one of the most beautiful places that we have here. Wow. But we have we have a lot more coming. You're if not, you're... Yes, I love that. <laughs> this man knows how to tease something. All right, thank you and so much. I can tell you, that pasta right there, the lobster rigatone, someone compared it to Carbone's the other day, and I was like, that's very flattering. No, so I, com... when I was looking at it, I was like, that kind of looks like Carbone's. Yeah, someone yeah, compared it, it to Carbone, and I think that that's very fl uh, flattering. And, you know, we're just doing a lot of exciting things here. We're hoping that the community and even people coming in really embrace it. Yeah. You know, like here, for example, I just turned a traditional Negroni wow. into a coconut fat wash Negroni. So okay, explain that. So we're taking a Negroni, we're putting it into coconut oil, putting it in the fridge so that the coconut Ooh. oil coagulates. That kicks you in the pants. And I like then, that. And then you, you <laughs> take the uh, coconut oil out yeah. and it still remains with that coconut flavor while still I being I just learned Negroni. about washing with things like... Uh, rice washing with, yeah. to kind of like pull out some of those a little bit harsher flavors. Oh, I want you to check out our, is back. Our, our new dessert, which I think is amazing. What's that dessert? I mean, this is our, our new dessert, and again, gorgeous. <laughs> people, people's favorite. Uh, this one is close to my heart because I, I really love tres leche. It's always been one of my favorite desserts. I love so it. This it's is, almost too pretty to eat, huh? So this is a mango. This is a mango tres leches with a mascarpone mango mango whipped cream. Yeah. And again, it's a uh, People are loving this. <laughs> Basically, you just have to come and try it. Cheers, everybody, to Pearl Provisions and Tipples. Thank you so much for having Cheers. us, Chef and Moses. Thank you for joining We've us. We've had the best time. Guys, sending it back to you. Look forward to see you soon. Bring that drink home.
Mm. And that dessert. And the dessert, tres Please? leches. Oh my goodness, I'll I love that. I'll choose a good dessert over a drink any day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, how you can make a 